morning, Chargers. Welcome back to WRSN. We are so thrilled to share with you the exciting news for today. Today we will be looking at sports, the Starter Rebound Week, and more. Let's, Let's get, get right, right into, into it. it. Each day, we should appreciate the beauty that surrounds us. We should focus on the positive and have gratitude for the, thing, the little things. You're so right. I really think we should celebrate life. Hey, did you know today is a celebration of Life Day? Yes, I actually knew that was today. You know who celebrate life right now? The girls varsity basketball team, since they won their game last Wednesday. Let's toss it over to Hayden for a recap of this game. On Wednesday, January 17th, the girls varsity basketball team played home against Wellington High. Before the game, they did many practices, making sure that they were ready to dominate the court. Throughout the game, our Lady Chargers fought very well, making incredible passes and shots and having amazing defense. After a tight first half of the game, the score was 19-17, with our Chargers just barely ahead. Although our girls were playing well, they still thought they could have improved. I feel like we could improve our communication by picking one another up, because it was a lot of us down out there first quarter which put us in a drought. Yeah, more like just, you know, being there for each other and picking each other up when we fall. After some more practice and pep talks, our Chargers were ready to get back in the game. In the second half, both teams fought very well, trying their absolute hardest to win. At the end, both teams tied with a score of 42 to 42, going into overtime. With Felia shooting the most free throws, she gives her thoughts on how she felt for one of them. The two free throws to get us into overtimes, it was nervous because I had been in a line about four games. So I was nervous of going into overtime, making a free throw to make the overtime. Even though the game was still going on, our Lady Chargers didn't give up and kept going for the win. After overtime, both teams tied again with a score of 49 to 49, going into a second overtime. In the second overtime, Candace had the last two free throws missing one and making the other, ultimately leading to the win. The last two free throws, I was nervous. I'm not going to lie. I was nervous, but, you know, I just kind of zoned everybody out and I, you know, I did what I had to do and, you know, to lead the game. With the game coming to an end, the final score was 52 to 51, with our Chargers barely taking the win. Great job, girls. Here are some final thoughts on the game. We underestimated them. That's, that's all I can really say. Um, but we came out and we did what we had to do to get the job done at the end of the day. Two overtimes. Two overtimes. Came out with a dumb dumb. <laughs> sure did. <laughs> Reporting for WRSN, this has been Hayden. Thanks, Hayden. Speaking of basketball, today is our first day of Rebound Week. Today's theme was Represent, where you rep your favorite teams by wearing their jersey. Let's take a look at some of our Chargers repping their teams today. Looking clean, guys. Tomorrow's day is Recreate. Where you recreate your favorite characters or celebrities. Hey, Anna, where's your jersey? Uh, I don't have it right now, so let's move on from this. Attention, seniors. The senior group photo has been moved to the 31st, so make sure to dress to impress. Also, cap and gown portraits are the 24th, but an extra day was added, which is the 31st. See your email for more details and to make an appointment. Enough said. Now let's check out some fun clubs meeting today. Wow, those are some radical clubs. Before we send you guys off, we want to wish a happy birthday to our Chargers celebrating their birthdays today. Live it up, party people. That's all we have for today. This has been Kristan and Anastasia. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.